More than two thirds of cars now come with a tyre repair kit instead of a spare wheel. And while these kits aren't always popular with drivers, if your car has one, you'll need to know how to use it. If you get a puncture, pull over and stop as soon as you find a safe place, preferably away from traffic. Apply the handbrake and switch your engine off and turn on your hazard lights if necessary. Now take a look at the puncture. Sealant kits will only fill holes up to about four millimetres across. So if you've got a nail in your tyre, that's fine. But if the tyre's torn or the alloy wheel itself is damaged, you're going to need to call a breakdown service. You'll find your repair kit in the boot. It'll either be in the side panels or as here under the boot floor. Now it consists of two parts, the bottle of sealant and the compressor for pumping up the tyres. If you do have an object like a nail in your tyre, don't try to remove it. Just unscrew the valve cap and attach the sealant bottle. And once attached, the pressurised sealant will spread around inside the tyre. On this Toyota, the air compressor for inflating the tyres is then attached to the back of the bottle. However, on many other cars, you'll need to unscrew the bottle and attach the air compressor directly to the valve on the tyre. Now it's time to inflate your tyre. So take the lead from the compressor and plug it into the cigarette lighter or 12 volt socket inside your car. Then start the engine. Now turn the compressor on and inflate the tyre until it reaches the recommended pressure shown in your car's handbook. If the tyre isn't inflating properly, try rolling the car forward a few metres to help the sealant spread around. If that doesn't work, you may still need to call a breakdown service. If you manage to repair the tyre, well done, you can carry on driving, but you'll need to stop a couple of miles down the road to check your tyre pressures again. And remember, this is only a temporary fix, so drive gently and keep your speed below 50 miles an hour. When you get to a garage, remember that you'll need to buy a new can of sealant and a new tyre, which tests every aspect of tyre performance, from wet braking to wear. So check our reviews before you buy. Click the links to find out our best buy tyres, read our guide to saving money on tyres and find out which breakdown companies we recommend.